Welcome back to In Coach, everybody. And today we are doing a delicious, nutritious, yet affordable calabash and dry shrimp curry with braised bhaji or wild herbs. These are fantastic. Here we have chilies, onions, and coriander, which we're going to rustically chop. That adds the base of our curry. We also got tomato and some curry leaves with the ginger and garlic chopped as well. As I say, not too much fuss, rustically chopped. We're gonna add some spices as well. Here we've got um, smoked chili flakes again, coriander, turmeric, uh, Kashmiri chili, white pepper as well. These are all my favorite combinations. Here we also have the butter calabash, and these need to be cut uh, or peeled with a vegetable peeler, right down to the flesh, expose the flesh, the very delicious and succulent flesh. Uh, also need to scoop out all the seeds, which makes it, the curry very bitter. The dry shrimp again, um, full of uh, protein, lots of antioxidants in there also, uh, all the omega-3 is still in there. They just need to be soaked in some bo boiling water and reconstituted slightly, and then drained in, uh, of all the water. These are very, very flavorsome. You can see we've just put the chunky cut uh, calabash in the, in the chutney, so we made a chutney with the onions and tomato, the, all the herbs and the chilies and the garlic, and we've added the water to that. We're gonna let this cook down for about 15, 20 minutes. Really let the, the calabash soften and glossy. Uh, this is the, the amazing amaranth and um, or what we call bhaji, sour herbs and green herbs, really, really uh, full of all your fiber and the goodness for your gut health. Yeah, we're also adding the, the chutney base ingredients, onions, tomato, chilies, uh, ginger and garlic and the curry leaves. Uh, really the cooking, let it cook down beautifully uh, let it reduce bring out those flavors concentrate all those flavors wilt the wilt the leaves as well yeah you can see the the the, the calabash curry is cooked down properly now it's nice and soft and tender Con the flavors have been concentrated you can see we've dished a beautiful portion here a combination of the two and we're going to serve it with our um, flourless we got coconut flatbreads here and so look out in the future for this recipe hope you enjoy that and uh, see you soon.